Hey guys, this is David with Two Dreams Fitness. This is my wife, Andrea, and we're here today on a comparison video for bags. We know there's a ton of bags out there for meal preps, and I have gone through a, a lot of bags. Uh, I like bags. And so we're doing the six pack fitness bag versus wolf pack. <laughs> Her wolf pack bag. Now, the thing you're gonna notice right off the bat, Mine is just a plain, solid black. Matter of fact, I love Sick Back Fitness, but give some bad color options. Black, I'm not sure they even have another option of colors. There are other colors. It's, just, it's not fancy. like that though. You don't need no fanciness of the pink camouflage. Yeah, can't get pink camouflage. <laughs> so six pack, six pack Fitness, get some, uh, some different color options. So, besides the visual of the color options, I don't have any uh, personalization on the front, like your back. Mine has lots of places where I can Velcro, and I even added more Velcro strips so I could put even more on the bag. <laughs> it's fun, it's fun to personalize it. Hey, I'm not gonna lie because I have, a, I have one just like that, but it's not a meal pack bag, it's a gym bag, and I've got the same thing, which I love. Hold over video, but this is a meal video. So, six pack fitness. So, you would think, Six meals, six pack, nah, close. I can do five meals. Now, here's a major difference between my bag and her bag. Now, they do make a larger bag than this, because she has the 35L. One, two, three, four, five. Five full regular containers in the bag. And if you need it cold, I have that option, where it's got this pull-out piece here. You can add, it's got a zipper. And you can add meal, meal. You can add ice packs in here. So the front face is all ice. You can stick ice packs in here. I believe you have the same option. I do. I have where I can put one really solid. It really keeps it cold in the zipper in the pot for the meal management part of my bag. And you've got three meals. There are a whole bunch of stuff around here. I have three boxes plus all my veggies my bagel, my fruit, and then three of these little boxes. But I probably eat a little less food than him. So besides that one, we're doing three, but more space around it. Now, what's, more, what's really cool about this bag, in my opinion, for the six pack, is okay, I can, I can I have some flexibility. I can do bigger containers in the trays. There's no trays in the wolf pack. I don't think even in the big one there's trays. I do like the trays because it makes it easy to stack and they don't fall out when you open the lid. But you can, what I really do like on the six pack fitness, is, is there are snaps inside so you can take the entire grid out, clean it, whatever you want to do, which is super cool. Um, and then you could just have one big open space to do whatever you want with. Yeah. I, I like this a lot. Um, it's probably, I would say this to me is a, not a deal breaker, but this to me is a big plus um, for six pack over, over that bag. But mine comes with silverware. It's a knife, <laughs> fork, and spoon in this little thing. So silverware is a great thing. What kind of case is that? It is, I don't know. It's really kind of challenging to open. <laughs> I, I have to it comes, really it comes in this beautiful case that you can't open. You can't use. <laughs> but when you open it, it has a knife, fork, and spoon that oh. are metal. So it's not like plastic wear. Kind of nice if you do have meat to cut or something that you didn't cut at home. Well, now I didn't even notice it has a wolf pack thing at the bottom. Yeah, it has a little so wolf, wolf pack. It's fancy. It looks more it's like a nice. camping kind of thing. It, well, well, hiking, duh, right? Hiking. <laughs> so very good. I love that, and I just always I don't use it very often because then I have to wash them. But I always keep them in there for an emergency. <laughs> keep them in with my ice pack. Now. Both bags do have the ability, it looks like on the front, with putting in zippers, or putting zippers, uh, having zippers to put in, you know, some condiments. You know, I have silverware, you know, I have drink packets, you know, things like that in the, in the front section, which looks like you can vitamins, too. protein bar, my stevia, drink packets, Motrin, I got all my stuff in there. So all that's the same. Now, again, mine's a meal bag, but I do have the large one and you can put quite a bit of stuff. So you have your food here in your containers 
and we'll dip this up. Now, one thing I will tell you right off the bat, because I've had this for many years, um, and I love some type of fishes, but you, if you can't tell from there, when there's nothing in it, and there wasn't really much in hers either, see how flimsy mine is? I mean, it's, it's when it stands up, it's, it's, <laughs> it's very limp. It, it, it just falls over. Uh, hers is very solid, stable, upright, you know, that sort of thing. So, now you have this big section, obviously for food. You have this section, obviously for whatever you want, you know, silverware, uh, drink packets. And then I have another section that you can put behind here. It's, I don't know if you can see that or not, but there's another, you know, zipper to put, you know, some more food. And then you have another section behind here where you just got this cool liner. I don't know if you see that or not. See, that you can put more stuff in. You've got another pocket back here. So typically I'll put, you know, some more food back there, some, some drinks, um, you know, things of that nature. Now you have, and you have a big open compartment behind I your actual food? I do, if the food isn't in it, it's bigger. But when the food is in it, I don't know if you can see. The food actually goes into that compartment. So not as much stuff could have been in there, but I do usually have an extra water bottle and my workout gloves in there. And it has a little pocket Velcro. We could organize some items in there. You could put a wallet, you could put extra phone, accessories, headphones. Now you got a water bottle in there, but you have these side pockets on the side. I'm curious. I have side pockets for water bottles. So. See, your side pockets I like because they have these, what, bands, I guess? Yeah, holds elastic them. bands. Elastic bands, so it kind of helps it adjust to the water bottle. Mine, that's the biggest difference over here. I have them, but there's no bands. And you have to find a water bottle that's small enough. But see, this is the normal, you guys are probably familiar with this shaker bottle. This is the uh, Gila Mix. And um, when you put it in there, it, it doesn't zip up. <laughs> it's, it doesn't fit, see? So you, you, I, I never use this because it won't fit a regular shaker bottle. And they fall out. And they fall out. Yeah. <laughs> and they fall out all the time. But this one, shockingly, it doesn't look like it could fit it, but it can actually fit that bigger shaker bottle in the side too. And mm -hmm. it goes all the way down in and it will not fall out. It's really snug Yeah. In there. I love it. Yeah. Oh, thanks. <laughs> so, Again, both of them are very similar in the front and, and, and putting in the containers. This has the grid system or shelving system, whatever. That one does not. I think it's a huge plus. They both have interior deals. But one thing that mine also has that uh, I really like, I never really use it for much because I use it just for uh, meals, but it does have a back zipper area that you can see this. It's all felt, black felt. So it's got a little pocket right here. I can put iPad, tablet, boom, right in there. I could put a small, you know, maybe change of clothes or a tablet or something else or a PC, Mac, whatever, <laughs> inside of there to uh, to uh, take with me up for on the go. But again, there's no structural integrity, I guess, to the bag. It's very soft. There's no back pocket. Um, like hers has a back pocket on the back. This one has a back pocket. It's padded iPad and it's very padded, so where I'm wearing it as a backpack, it doesn't hit my, I can't even tell that the iPad's in there. It's very comfortable right there. And that's just about a little slot. Now on your straps, your straps are different. So your straps, check this out. So, so if you're using this for hiking, especially walking, whatever, your straps have some serious nice padding to them. I have a little bit of padding, not a lot, but mine only has one, um, chest strap. I have no lower straps. She has two sets of straps, right? You have the chest strap, yeah, and then you have the lower strap for around the waist. So for someone that's taking their food on the go to go hiking long distance, mm -hmm. that looks to be a much, much um, more comfortable bag. Yeah, so much support for all of the weight that might be in the bag, it'll support it all. So it's really easy to carry. Now mine has a back, my back pocket is, I feel a lot better than yours, but just because of the way it opens up, it opens up a long zipper and you can open it up flat as you pack all of your stuff in, kind of like carry-on luggage. You can have all your toiletries, your hair, 
hair accessories. I'm always been, my, I take up so much space for hair accessories. I mean, yeah, you do. I mean, this whole back section is, is hair accessories. You probably need a bag just for that. <laughs> what about my face lotion? Like everything to get cleaned up after the gym. And things that I keep up, keep in here just for in case of emergency, like extra socks and my extra deodorant, all my things that I would need to get ready for. I would say as a meal bag, like multi-purpose bag, this, not that I want to give that the one up, but just opening up all the way, like luggage, is huge, I think. Just be able to put a change of clothes, things to go, you know, the the for the shower area. It's pretty deep space. It is pretty deep. You can, you can probably put a pair of shoes. You could pair of yeah, definitely put shoes in there. Pants, shirt, whatever. And my hoodie, I take off my hoodie and I can just shove it in in there at the gym. Like yeah. Shove, if, you, if you were doing clothes in this bag, <laughs> you would literally be shoving it in. <laughs> There's no organization to you just shove it in whatever would fit. Uh, but one thing to notice, so speaking of shoving things in, this has, which I really like, I have to put another one up on it, on the six pack, but this has the side straps. So this, what's cool about the side straps is when you do stuff a bunch of stuff in and you're traveling or you're gonna put an overhead compartment if you're, if you're going on a plane, you can actually put it and tighten it goes to kind of compress it even more to make it as small as you can with a full whatever you're putting in it. <laughs> yeah, to make it a lot smaller. Yeah. Yeah, I can't do that with mine. <laughs> you got all these extra hangers to put your stuff on. I don't have that either. So depending on what you're using with this bag, I mean, again, it's a meal bag, but then if you're doing other things besides just, just taking meals only, you know, that's a nice bag. They're both nice bags, but again, we want to show you guys just to compare the two, you know, picking one over the other. What we, I love my six pack fitness and I only use it for meals. I have another bag that I use to carry all my gym stuff and I love it. So again, I'm one of those guys that I carry four or five bags with me every single day. Uh, but if you're trying to do one bag and you only need to carry a few meals or if you need to carry more meals, you can just get the bigger bag or a wolf pack, but you also carry change of clothes, your, you know, toilets you shove, uh, where you probably wouldn't want to do that with a six pack. It's probably just food. So, yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, we got a lot more videos coming out. This one was a fun one because it's kind of like, which one's better, one or the other. Uh, it's not really competition or nothing, but um, I would only do meals in mind, never do what she does with that one. So if you're looking for something that you can kind of do both, that's a great option. So anyway, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Give us a thumbs up and we'll see you guys on the next one. See you guys.